as you can see here there is no Wi-Fi connection available if I open settings there is no connection showing and either no Wi-Fi option available either here or wireless devices this as you can see in Wi-Fi devices this is a problem which is occurring in most of the Windows 8.1 latest cases so this is a, a usual problem which are we are going to solve today so this is a driver problem we need to install a driver a Wi-Fi adapter drivers for this Windows so as you can see I have uh, almost uh, installed this driver and I have got this Wi-Fi options so this options was not available so I will tell you a easy method to install this Wi-Fi options as you can see the in the connections where the options was not available there was Wi-Fi options was not available but I got this option here so to get this Wi-Fi options you need to install one software called IOBit driver booster so after this software installing you need to install the drivers and you, you need to update uh, the missing drivers as you can see I can connect everything so let's get started and we will install the driver so first we need to open chrome after opening chrome we need to search iobit driver booster after searching iobit driver booster just enter then open on first link download driver booster then after that you need to download it from the free download source I, I have already downloaded it so I will cancel this installation I will download then after this driver booster setup you, it will appear then you need to open it and then it will install you need to click install and then uh, I have auto al already installed driver booster I will cancel the installation you you should install this driver booster after installation you need to run it as administrator after running it as administrator you should connect with an Wi-Fi through via USB then after that scan it then after scanning it will scan for us uh, till 100% then as you can see you should you should update the missing drivers first the main problem is the missing drivers you you should update all the missing drivers and you should update all the drivers after updating all the drivers and all the missing drivers then your Wi-Fi option will be installed and your Wi-Fi driver will be installed and you can see your Wi-Fi option available you should update every system devices every system devices first internet adapters every drivers you should update all drivers up to date and first of all for the first thing is you should you should download the missing drivers if it is mentioned missing drivers here so as you can see I've got the Wi-Fi options um, I have connected to Wi-Fi so that's a very easy problem you easy problem and very easy solution thank you for watching my video and don't forget to like and subscribe